Can morning. everybody say good morning? Say good morning. Good morning. It is Saturday morning. Daddy ran sad because we thought she thought we were leaving her cut, but Daddy went in to get it. It is Saturday morning. Daddy is off work. And he said, we're going to wake up in the morning. He said this yesterday. We're going to go to breakfast. <laughs> we used to do this all the time, but he works a lot of Saturdays now and hadn't done it in a long time. So we're headed to the pancake place and we're headed yeah. to get breakfast. And then we've got a lot on the agenda today, so we're going to do that. Y'all excited to eat breakfast? Yay! Go to family breakfast. And then um, after that, we got to head to Lowe's. And we're going to start our bathroom project today. So we're going to head to breakfast, and we're going to Lowe's. Breakfast was delicious. We are at Lowe's picking up some paint. I'm going to look for my shelves that I want in the bathroom. That's what I'm looking at now. There's a big thing in front of them. But we are doing some shopping. Still um, don't know the paint color we're going to choose. I think we're just going to do what we have throughout the majority of our house. Just because it's a neutral. It looks good. So I think that's what we're going to do. Is just play it safe and do something like that. But um, I think there's, we're going to put like some kind of shelving like that. One of those. You can't really see it. Alright, we are back from Lowe's. I think we got the stuff that we needed. I do need to go Hobby Lobby later. Um to look for a few more things and Walmart. We'll have to go to Walmart later too. But for now, we've got everything we need to paint in there. We also picked up the shelving that I am pretty sure we're gonna use, unless I find something I like better at Hobby Lobby. But I think we're gonna use those. They're, um, I've actually been looking at these for a long time. Um, we got two of them. We also got a few more things when we were on date night last night to go like on the shelves. Thought we could put maybe some like toilet paper in here, um, stuff like that. But we got our paint back there. We decided to go with the color we have in the majority of our house. Um, but this this kind of stuff overwhelms me because I am not the good at decorating, and I don't have an eye for it. And so we're gonna at least go ahead and get the paint, get the shelving and stuff up probably. And then I'll kind of go from there. I did. I feel like I picked up a couple of cute things though to go with the shelving, uh, the shelves. And um, I have an idea of what else I want to go on there. I just didn't find anything yesterday, so I'm hoping Hobby Lobby also has something. But I did. We did pick up that. Ethan helped me pick that out to go on there. Um, I Pinterest. I looked on Pinterest for ideas for that. Um, but there is also a few more things we need to pick up probably from Walmart. I think we're gonna I probably will get like a shower new shower curtain from Walmart and like the wall hook for a towel from Walmart and maybe like a new toothbrush holder from Walmart um, Things like that and then also we need to look for a few more decorative items that I'm might just have to order online but i'm going to see if like walmart or hobby lobby has anything but we're gonna i'm gonna go change clothes get so get comfy and we're gonna start painting this bathroom i don't think it's going to take too long we're gonna do a couple coats i'm sure but we do um we filled in a couple holes in the wall we have to sand those down and wipe the walls down really good and then we'll be ready to paint Hobby Lobby. We got a lot, most of the painting done. 
come here to get some decor and realize most of the stuff is not 50% off so we're gonna have we're gonna come back we are getting one thing but we're gonna come back Monday to get a couple signs to go in there but right now I'm looking for little canisters I don't know what kind of little canisters to put on my shelf to put like cotton balls and um, q-tips and stuff in that's what I'm thinking so do you see a canister that'll look cute some kind of probably just like a small couple small like glass canisters oh and they're 50% off so perfect um so I need to look back on Pinterest see what other people have but I don't know if I want the wood probably just like this what you think you like that something like that looks like a good size it's over bless here you. bless you oh sorry Ryan. sorry Ryan. look what look how daddy has her <laughs> they're watching the phone so we can get some stuff done um or something like this I've saw some people have stuff like that too all right we ended up getting the canisters we ended up getting that shelf so we're gonna see which shelf I like the best we've got the ones from Lowe's so we'll figure it out what I, I think I'm gonna like the one from Hobby Lobby better. I wish it were a little bit longer, but um, it might actually work out really good. I think I'm gonna put that and then a sign underneath it. Low lighting. But um, yeah, I'll probably come back Monday when everything's 50% off and um, get whatever other decor that I want. Or I might find some stuff at Walmart. I'm gonna look there too. We are headed to supper. I get really overwhelmed when it comes to decorating and figuring out what to put in there I seriously get so overwhelmed I feel like by the time it's done it ends up looking pretty good um, when I'm working on stuff redoing stuff but I get really overwhelmed so I think what we've got so far is gonna look good sorry for the light this is terrible Millie <gasps> did we come to supper so we came to show Mars what y'all get a hot dog yeah. and what'd you get Mac and cheese? Yeah. Yeah. All right, it's actually the next day. We, go, we just got home from church and got done eating lunch, but I wanted to show you guys the progress that we've done in here. We are not completely done, but we actually changed out a lot of stuff in here and done a lot more than I feel like we were planning to do. But I feel like as we were going with it, I was like, okay, since we're doing it, we might as well do it right and do everything change out as much as we can in here other than like like something huge like changing out the tile and the bathtub and cabinets and all that but we did we updated and um did as much as we could without getting too deep into it but we actually did a lot we're not completely done can you say hey ryan hi you eating chicken nuggets <laughs> nobody wants to see that but it looks really good so far um, I'll show you guys what we've done and then what else we plan on doing um, probably tomorrow. Hi. So, you say hey? Hi. You eating chicken nuggets? Free tries? No. Two free tries? Okay. So we ended up, I'll turn you guys around. Let me, I'm trying to get everything out of the floor and stuff. This is the main bathroom that everybody uses. Ah! <laughs> and so, um, it has to be like, it gets a mess every day. Okay. So let's walk in here and let me show the peeps. So this bathroom, we have two bathrooms in our house, but this is the main one everybody uses. Um, we get ready in here, but Ethan and I shower in the other one. We have like a big shower in there. So we're gonna eventually get to that project. Don't mind my lounge, lounge wear after church. It is Sunday. Sundays are for church and naps for us. <laughs> but as we walk in, so the first thing, um, one of the things we did, so we definitely painted in here, but we also ended up changing out the hardware on the door and painting the door. This was brass and we're gonna actually, um, on our other bedroom doors, there's also brass. So we're gonna eventually change out all the hardware on the other doors that, are br that have brass on them and change out the um, doorknobs and the hinges and all of that and we actually we're gonna do that and paint all of the other doors as well so that's another project that we were like okay since we're starting this might as well do the rest of them like um you can tell out with the brassiness and it needs painting and all that but that's the first thing we did um take the door off paint it and change all the hardware out that made a big difference the next thing we did we painted the cabinets which look so much better we just painted them white kept all the hardware that was on them because it just matches everything else went ahead and done that um i obviously kept the counters because we wasn't getting that deep into it 
we did I, we did pick that out of that up at Walmart we needed a new one of those um, I can't decide if I'm gonna keep it on the counter or put it down here but for now we're just gonna keep it on the counter I think it does look good we also changed out those and we got a new towel rack I picked up some new little towels at Walmart too and then over here um, that's one of the decor items another yeah so we painted in here and um, paint it. These are Revere. The uh, walls are Revere Pewter, which is what we have throughout the rest of our house. Um, and I decided to keep it neutral, keep it something that I know looks good. When we first started painting, and when I saw it next to the color that was in here previously, we were like cutting like the edges and stuff, and I was like, oh no, this is not gonna look good. But I love it. It ended up being perfect. It matches the rest of our house and just a perfect neutral. Um, Revere Pewter by Benjamin Moore is the color. Um, and then I love it. Like, I love the white down here. I think it looks so good. Let me close this. It looks so much better. And then this up here, we had two um, different shelves that we had bought. And we ended up going with this one. This is from Hobby Lobby. Um, we also had another one uh, that came with two from or we bought two of them from Lowe's I ultimately just ultimately decided I just love the look of this so this was actually from Hobby Lobby I think it was like 30 something dollars for the whole thing so it ended up being cheaper than the one at Lowe's I got this at um, TJ Maxx love that and then I got the canisters at Hobby Lobby I just got um, some things that we use a lot cotton balls co uh, cotton swabs and then uh, Q-tips, whatever. I got that at TJ Maxx as well. So that is my favorite thing in here. I think it turned out so cute. And I think I'm gonna get a sign to put underneath here is what I'm thinking, or something to put right there. I'm not sure, probably like a sign to put underneath there. And then that's something else that we've gotta get. I can't figure out what to put up there, but we definitely have to get something to put up there as well. If you guys have any suggestions, let me know because I'm still not completely sure what to put up there. So we're definitely gonna do something there and put something underneath there. And then the next thing we did, um, we changed out the toilet paper holder and then we also got a new shower curtain and new rings for it. This is just white. This is from Walmart. It's got like a texture on it if you can kind of tell the little like dotted texture. Just wanted something white and neutral. Just wanted the bathroom to be pretty neutral because like everybody uses it. If you come into our home, this is the bathroom you would use. So yeah, this is from this angle. I, I would also probably like something to go up there as well. I think that would look good, but that is mainly it. What do you got? You got a unicorn squishy thing? It's not a squishy <laughs> thing. You can stretch it. Oh yeah. Cool. But yeah, that is it. Love that. That turned out exactly how I wanted it. Um, there's not a whole lot of space on there to put other stuff. Like, that's pretty much as full as I think we can get it. Like, if we wanted to change out, like, something. Like, if we wanted to get rid of those little canisters and put them underneath the sink and put, like, a sign there. But I actually love the way that looks. And last, oh, I am forgetting something. Last thing we did is underneath the cabinets. We only painted on the outside of the cabinets. I didn't go in the cabinets and paint so they're not like the prettiest inside, but um, it looks, they, they look so much better like on the outside painted. But um, last thing we did was underneath the cabinets, I went ahead and got some bins to organize better down there. When I, I think I done in one of my videos, I can't remember exactly like a deep cleaning of this bathroom. I think I showed some of that and decluttered underneath the cabinet yes i did now i remember decluttered underneath the cabinet but i needed to get new bins and i picked those up at walmart last night i went to the dollar tree because they're only a dollar at the dollar tree i didn't see white ones there that's what i wanted just white ones i didn't want colored ones so i did pick them up at walmart and it looks so much better so i'll go ahead and show you guys that too better look at the cabinets they look so good like the paint job and i apologize for the camera it's been blurry but in here we've got um three bins there's my makeup thing um just because i use that every day so we've got three bins there's just from walmart we've got some stuff like a bunch of like random toiletries like especially like things um like travel stuff that i want to keep and then some of ethan's stuff and in here we've got my like mostly my hair products uh like my hair tools and then in here we've got a lot of my skincare and hair um hairspray and 
texturizes and spray and things like that. So that definitely is a whole lot better. But other than that, it looks so much better. I'm excited to change, um, slowly change out all the door stuff in the rest of the house, which is really like our basement door, the bedroom doors, and like the hallway closet is mainly it. So we're gonna like slowly do that as we get time. We're gonna definitely change all that out and paint those. They're very old doors, but that actually looks really good since we like updated and painted it. So we're just gonna keep them all. And that's just like a project that don't take a lot of money to do, but it definitely like really updates the house. And so I just wanted to show you guys the bathroom, the progress. That is the progress so far. I'm, we're definitely gonna get something for here and probably something up there and then something to go probably underneath right there and that is mainly it we just wanted we actually did i feel like we've done a lot in here I actually took the whole day we didn't go to bed until like after two o'clock this morning <laughs> so because we were finishing this and i had to finish up the video we spent like all day on this but it turned out so good i'm so happy with the color wasn't sure if i'd like it as we were painting but love it and it's just the perfect neutral it's like um more of a beige than a gray like a grayish beige but more so beige in here um but yeah i just wanted to show you guys that this definitely um looks so much better in here not a huge huge transformation with new cabinets and um a new bathtub and new tile and stuff like that but um it definitely updated our bathroom so i'm very happy with what we have done especially on a budget i feel like this was all on a budget too so i'm gonna go ahead and end this here I feel like I've talked about this way too much over the last few minutes. Like, I feel like this video is getting a little long. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you guys have any suggestions on what I could put on that wall. I'm going to go to Hobby Lobby because um, everything should be 50% off next week. So, I'm going to go there and just see if I can see, find anything. So, project one of a few projects we're going to be working on soon. The next is our living room fireplace and decorating in there, decorating our mantle and things like that. So I'm excited for that. Whitewashing the fireplace, painting all that. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to end it here. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.